Let's now move on to the fun part of the show, the style files. I'm going to ask you a few questions and all you have to do is really quickly and spontaneously answer them. Hmm. So are you ready? Sure. Bad boy of Khuda ke liye or Prince Charming of Khub Surat? Bad boy of Khuda ke liye? <laughs> yeah, I guess Prince Charming of Khub Surat. Which one do you prefer, the beard or the clean shaven look? Beard, that's so easy and convenient not to shave. But you look amazing, even, you know, yeah. when you don't I have a beard. I could completely go rip plan when you know. <laughs> Okay. I can probably grow a beard that goes to the floor. That's how lazy <laughs> I am. No, we don't want that. <laughs> That'll be a bit too much. Bangala or Patani suit? Bangala. Your favorite fashion accessory? Is you have to pick square. one pocket square. Yeah. That obvious. Yeah. If you were not a musician or an actor, what would you have been? Fashion designer? I would have been a housefly. It would have been a, yeah. I, no, no, no. We can't yeah, see would, you as a housefly. I can completely do that. I swear to God. I wonder what the missus would say to that. Okay, moving on. The three most stylish women in India. Mm. That's Sonam Bura, obviously, is one of them. I like how Deepika Yes, totally. Devilicious. Yeah, mm -hmm. she, really, she really dresses well, very smartly. Third person would be, I guess, Tangana? Yes. Because she, You're bang on, yes. she keeps on trying new things. Which yeah, is like very something experimental. Like, that's what I think is nice and cool. Is when you are ballsy enough to actually try something and if it doesn't work, you're like, so who cares? Yeah, right? attitude. That attitude. Yeah. That's what we're talking about. That's, 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 that's great. What. According to you, who has the worst sense of style in Bollywood? Do you want to skip that answer? <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> you wouldn't be caught dead wearing. There will not be one. Okay, there will be many. Then you should at least give us one. I don't want to get you in trouble. Other. Okay. <laughs> you wouldn't be caught dead wearing. Bell bottoms, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. Boot cuts. I hate boot cuts. That's something that just like sort of irritates me when I see men wearing it. Okay. The one question you hate answering in interviews. Well, uh, that definitely have to be. Doesn't your wife get bothered with so much attention that you get? Oh, God. That one is. <laughs> It's ridiculous and stay... It's, yeah, it's yeah. happened too many times now. Really? How did she take it? That kind of thing. Um, well, she's kind of an problem. independent, successful fashion designer, she I've been designer. told, yeah. And she must be very proud of you. I'm very proud of her, actually. Mm -hmm. I think uh, I owe everything to her, to her patience with me. That's sweet. Okay, so tell us, what do you wear at home when you're just lounging around? We're all very curious. Is it a bangala? No, <laughs> no, no, not at all. <laughs> I'm just pulling your leg. Yeah, it's, I think shorts and a t-shirt, actually. So you do lounge around lounge in casual. Kind of yeah. yeah, cool. Oh. Oh. First thing you notice in a woman? Hands and feet. Hmm, interesting. Mine are all manicured today. <laughs> Good for you. I get my, I'm not wearing my glasses. Okay. So I'm not looking. I'm not staring. Okay. Your sex appeal lies in your? My sex appeal lies in my voice. I'm sure all the women out there are going, oh yes, that voice. So tell me, how long do you take to get all dappered up? Ages. Really? I actually hate first getting into the process, getting ready and getting out. You know, it's like breaking your rhythm from one thing and going to another. Mm -hmm. So it's like a, I'll go, I'll have a, probably have a cup of tea. I'll turn on the water, I'll turn on music and then I'll just sit outside, have a cup of so tea. So you enjoy that whole process. So I'm process. just like going in and out. Yeah. It's more about the fact that, you know, I'm just too distracted with 10 other things. Your biggest fashion faux pas? I started matching my tie color and my pocket square. Okay. And I do a ditto. I hope everybody is listening to that. You shouldn't. You shouldn't. <laughs> totally. In fact, you should steer away from as much as what it is inside on the outside. Well, that's an amazing style tip. One style tip for men when they are out on a date. Don't try too, too hard, hard to impress yeah. a girl. Don't try too hard. Completely agree. Describe your style in three words. Confident, elegant and I guess classy. You recently won the Most Beautiful Man Award at the Vogue Awards. Who is the most beautiful woman in India according to you? Okay, I decided to this at the Vogue Awards as well, and I completely stand by it. I'm a very, uh, I wouldn't say really, uh, you know, I'm not, I'm not a very Turkey guy. So you appreciate beauty? For some odd reason now, you might just think it's it's a bit weird and freaky of me. I do not stare, but I admire women. In general? Overall, in general, I think oh. I sort of find something or the other. Attractive. To, uh, yeah. To that was a beautiful at answer, least, by know, the way. To steal a glance at. Mm -hmm at all kinds of women. I think all that's ages. the reason women find you the sexiest man alive. <laughs> I Maybe, think that I is guess, the reason. Yeah. I'm a narcissist. <laughs> no, no, not at all, not at all. You spoke from the heart and I loved every bit of it.